Hello beautiful people. Let's do a nighttime sequence to close off your day and put peace in your heart while you quiet in your mind. First of all, take a deep breath in, hold momentarily and breathe out. Either close your eyes or go into your mind's eye. Ah, your day is done. No matter how it was, it is done. Doesn't need a label. Your day was your day. And well done in taking this time for yourself to close out your day. Up above you is a radiant full moon. It's surrounded by glimmering twinkling stars. The magic of the universe is all around you. Take some time to feel into this magical twinkling space. Count in for three as you breathe, hold and out for three. And just feel yourself relax. Just for a moment, tense up all the muscles in your body. Just squeeze, 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 squeeze. <sighs> Let it go. Just feel the relaxation seeping deeper into you. You under this full radiant moon. And now, Thank your mind for all its work today. I'm sure it was very helpful and probably no doubt busy. And just ask your mind to now step back and let your heart lead the way through this sequence that's gonna take you in to sleep. So just taking a moment to once again feel into the glimmering, sparkling stars and the light that they shed down onto you. Ah, relaxed under the moonlight. And now very quietly, start to scan back through your day Trying to let your heart show you what you need to remember rather than your mind. And think about or feel into any situations that you would like to let go of. They might have caused you anxiety or stress. They might have been upsetting or just unwanted in some way. So just go back to those and all you're going to do is just clear them out of your system. They're done and you don't need to take that energy with you. You don't need to hang on to any of that. It's now time to let them go. So imagining that moment, that experience, that interaction, whatever it was, and there might be several just want you to systematically go through and imagine a little bit like when you play a game of pass the parcel at a children's birthday party. You're going to wrap that moment up. You choose how you want to wrap it up. You might want to wrap it up in rainbows, it might be moonlit wrapping paper, it might be brown paper tied up with string. Anything you choose. I just want you to see yourself in that moment and you're layering that moment up and the feeling of that moment, the energy of that moment. Latch onto that and wrap it up. Layer one, it's wrapping it all up. And you put another layer and another layer and then you finish it off 
with a really moonlit layer. And now you're going to just send it off into the stars. Shoot it up and out of your memory system. Clear and transmute it into time, space, dimensions and realities. Taking a deep breath in and just saying, I clear and transmute you, this, whatever this was, I clear and transmute and see it shooting off into the universe, into time and space, dissolving and gone from your system. And now go through, just scan really, really gently. Don't overthink it. As I say, let your heart lead the way. Think about the people who featured in your day. And what we're going to do is just cut energetic cords with anyone who has probably unwittingly corded to you in a negative way. So people, people unconsciously cord with one another. We cord with all people that we have sort of interaction with and particularly people that we are close to. But often what happens is that we end up carrying uh, negative cords with people and that drains us. And the good thing about cord cutting is that it is for everybody's highest good. So you can't basically cut a cord that's about love, that's sort of a symbiotic um, or mutually beneficial um, connection. You can't cut cords like of, of love and joy and peace and harmony. What you can do is cut negative cords, cords of maybe codependence, code, cords where people latch onto you because you're, you're light and they're dark, because they, they might need your strength or they might need your energy in some way. And it's just not helpful to you and it's actually not really helpful for them either because they're giving away their power by doing that. So go through and just line up in your mind's eye. Might be one person, there might be ten. Quietly just see them stepping forward and under the moon. And you see the chords between you. Sometimes they're actually, you can actually see them as these sort of etheric, like little tubes or pipes running between you, or it might be a, a flow of light. Whatever you see is exactly what is meant for you. And now just say, I am going to cut all cords between us that are not for our highest good. And again, you see these cords dissolving and sort of dissolving up and shooting up into that wonderful moonlit sky. You're clearing and transmuting these cords up and out into the universe. And you're just feeling lighter, I would have thought, from that. Let's just take a moment to let you finish doing that. And you don't have to put a story on the attachments. They are what they are. You might know why they've happened or you might not. Again, your mind has been very courteous and stepped back and your heart has led this exercise and your heart knows and it just has that knowing. That's the wonderful thing about working from your heart. It just knows things that we can't always label or put a story to, but we just know that they're true. And so just be, you know, really grateful for this and, and have faith that this knowing is exactly what you're meant to be getting at this time. And once again, just work through these people these cords that are no longer serving you or them and let them go. And into the space that you've left as you've done this work, this really, really beautiful healing work for yourself. 
And you can do this every day, or you can do it once a month, whatever serves you, whatever you feel guided to do. But now you're going to cocoon yourself for the evening with that wonderful moonlight that is cascading in and around you right now. So breathing in deeply, breathing the moonlight in, feel it coming in through the top of your head and down through your system, through that straight spine. And it's just moving out through the bottom of your feet and, and coming back up and it's forming like a like a cocoon around you and it's wonderful and warm and soft, the soft warm moonlight and this energy is an energy of peace, an energy of safety, of being held, of being cared for and this is going to be your blanket as you sleep this evening. And so you bid farewell to that glorious moon and you give yourself a word of thanks for taking the time to do this cleansing work on yourself, to, for bringing yourself peace and harmony at the end of your day. And you are done. And I hope you sleep very well and have very sweet dreams. Thank you.